Hello. Did you? Did you talk to him? I know you. He's the looter. Yeah. <laughs> You're that good Sir Shinobi, sir. Well, I haven't seen you since. Well, since last night. Ah. He told us where the Mist Raven was. Yeah. He was at that building. Mm -hmm. I see. You don't remember. Mm. Yes, we do. Listen, sir, you and I, we met before. I was a thief back then. <laughs> but those days are behind me. Now, I'm an upright and honest merchant. Only problem yeah, okay. is I'm broke. And being broke, I don't have anything to sell. So oh, we have to invest money into him. Lending me just a few coins to get my business going. I'll talk something useful just uh, I suppose I think I it will. would be good. As Worth it. Bonus, I'll tell you all about that night. What do you think? Pretty good deal, right? <laughs> sure. Purchase information for Yeah, that's actually quite cheap. Here's some coin. <laughs> Thanks, good sir. Now talk. Yes. Yes, 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 of course. That night. <laughs> so my gang broke into the Hirata estate. Now, as you're aware, the Hirata family is part of the Ashina. Now, normally they'd mop the floor with petty thieves like us. I mean, no sweat. But it just so happens we broke in during a battle. Yeah. Almost all the young samurai were away from home. And it was a prime opportunity. Then... We started a fire and cleaned out the place. That there's when I met you. You, you were looking for something. At least, that's what it looked like to me. Well, that's all I know about that night. I see. Yeah, uh, that uh, look you're making now. <laughs> you had that same look on your face that night. You still looking for something? Listen, <laughs> good sir, for a price, I might be able to tell you some other tidbits you might find useful. Now for a price, sure. of course, I'm a, a merchant now, you know, so. So he doesn't have anything to sell us, but he'll have information. Anayama the Peddler. Huh, okay. Almost a palindrome there, but all right. So, 100 cent, do we even have 100 cent? I might have 100 cent. I'll yeah. buy some information. Thank you very much for your patronage. Hmm. Since you're a shinobi, I'll give you some information about shinobi tools, if you could. Now, I've seen this tube. A tube with fire blasting out of it. Huh? That's the flame vent. When we broke into the Harata estate, one of my pals nabbed one. <laughs> that's, that's the sound oh, the fire dear. makes when it blasts out. Flame Barrel Memo. A tattered note written by Anayama. Seems to be from some years ago. Lucrative info number 36. When we broke into the Harata estate, we found a barrel that spewed flame. The boys lit a roaring bonfire with it and made merry with the drink. Must have been a Shinobi's tool. So this guy will actually give us hints as to where to find all of the different Shinobi tools. That's interesting. Okay. I have one. I'll tell you this. <laughs> I already have it. I already have one. Huh? Well, that's a shame. <laughs> that one's on me. What happened? So this dude is telling us information of where to find shinobi tools, right? And he said, oh, you, there's this flamethrower in the Harata estate. And uh, the Sekiro just went, yeah, I already have one. And he's like, oh, well then. Have some oil. So let's see if he has anything more, more oh, for so us. Oh, so if we'd gone to him before that, there. then he would have said... Right, okay. And we can't talk to him anymore. Okay. But people apparently call him the Eye Patches, according to some people in the chat. Why? Uh, because he's kind of the dishonest merchant thief, but he helps you out if you pay him. So it's very similar to what Patches is like in uh, Bloodborne and Dark Souls. Okay. So there's not anything to open there, which makes sense. Uh, nothing there. What's so down there? What's down there? down here, that would be the entrance that I could have gone through, and there's an item. Pellets! We just landed on something that hurt. Uh, I didn't take any fall damage, so... I well, might have landed on a ow. pot. Well, it didn't take any damage, so... It was a, a fake ouch. Did you read all of these? R read all of uh, the chat? No, yeah. I didn't. 
He said, um, Nakora said, um, he didn't kick you off the cliff, but he did send you to where the purple ninja stomped you. Oh, uh, yeah. That's a good point. Okay, so, let's see. So, that's stairway, and it goes along here. That's where we could hug the wall. And I guess there is actually another way. Oh, no, you can just go over. That makes sense. So, there's the sculptor's idol. That's where the cockle was. Let's go this way, shall we? Do, 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 do. You can grab it. Um, mm, you can grapple it. I know. I was, I was trying to do the normal wall jump, but... It was an angle. Mm. So, yeah, that's the way we came. So this is just an alternate path to get around it. Okay. There's a tree to your left. Tree to the left? Mm, can't grapple it. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought you might be able to pick it off. Dum to dum. So, Sculptor's Idol... One dude. Any more dudes? Not just yet. Spirit emblem in the bonfire. I, I must admit, I've not been looking out for eavesdrop stuff as much. So, if anyone sees it, Pimsy included, point it out and I'll try and listen to something. Whoa, hang on. There we go. Your face with that big bastard just tied up next to us. I'd rather not be gravely injured just before the war begins. Fire. Ah. Dear fire. That's what the Lord Proclamation said. Proclamation. What a joke. Use the fire. That's why also the guy says go to Harata Estate to get it. Because. It's important. Yeah. So it's not the firecracker, it's the... Uh, it's the actual fire. Flame vent. Yeah. yeah. So... Are you going to kill them then? Yes, I will. Uh, yes, go for you. It kind of adds a bit of humanity to the enemies, doesn't it? Being able to, to listen eavesdrop. to them speak. Yeah, because they're humans. Okay, so the makes it more realistic. Is there anything in here? No. No. Okay. Dun -dun. You can turn around as well. Because that's where There's another tunnel there. The okay. shadows were. Uh, nothing. Yeah, that's where I just was. Okay. So that's the broken wall. This is hidden grass. No, nope, can't grab onto that. Well, you might be able to if you get on top of the roof there. True. No, oh, grapple. Literally your best thing that you can do in this game. Grapple. You just avoid using it. No, all. it's not that I avoid using it. It's I'm trying to get it when I don't have to because there's only certain points you can even use the grapple. Don't try that. No, I'm not going to. There's a grapple point there. So, I guess... Get your flamethrower ready. Flamethrower ready? There's too many hints at it. Yeah, and let's get oil on as well. Having that f hundred versions You've got of your oil... Gourd on. Yeah, having the lots of oil helps with getting the firecracker. Mm. Oh, he's got two death blows. So, if I can, I want to sneak up on him. Why? Because that would be beneficial. Does this go anywhere useful? No. I don't know, but has he seen you? Uh, no, I think he's just freaking out like he normally does. Mm. I don't think he can. I think I just throw it. It has to be. Oh, wait, up there. Yeah. Do, do, do. So this side, perhaps? Look up from now. Hmm. I'm not seeing another grapple point. Maybe you can't then. 
Hmm. All right. Well, I guess we'll try this dude. He's probably just trying to teach you to the legit use the way. Flamethrower. Yeah. He's chained up. I know he's chained up. I'm fully expecting him to break out. Chained ogre. Flamethrower. Ooh. Grab attacks cannot be deflected. Make sure you step dodge. Oh, you can grapple on him. I think you there need the axe. There was something behind him. Can you pause? Hmm? Pause. Pause. Have you got the axe on? Put the axe instead of the... Um, sure yeah, again. Because he's got a shield on his head. Yes, he does. Okay, so... Flamethrower. No, I dodged. I dodged. So this is a double, yeah. Get up on the tree to avoid him. Oh, that's it. That's the momentum thing. What? So the green triangle thing that came up. Oh, okay. You're dead. Mm -hmm. You might as well resurrect. Yeah, okay. And you know you're not far away from the thingy, but. Back it up. Now. Oh, so you can grapple onto him. Yep. Ah, and that's why the skill for the grapple comes in handy. Ah. Why did you do that there? Because you need to heal, dude. I need to take my opportunities to attack him. Ooh. Okay, let's heal. What? Hmm. Maybe not. Not with two people. <laughs> Drop attack? On who? The ogre. It doesn't hmm. work because they're both alert. Nice. Death Where's blood. the ogre gone? Uh, he's to the right. Oh, there Hello. he is. Nope. Back it up. Axe might be useful. Nope. Still flame vent. Right. I don't want to use my flame vent. Just he's yet. dead. No, he's got one death blow. Okay. Now I need to make sure that the other one's ready. Okay. No! Whoa, run away. I didn't get him with the burn. That's fine. Whoop. 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 I can't use any you of my... You could use the oil and the flame back again. No, I can't. Okay, then use the axe. I can't. I've not got any more things. All right, I'm dead. Do you need that for the axe? You need... Yeah, of course you do. You need all, right, all I the didn't, shinobi tools. I didn't know that. Every move this enemy has is stolen from WWE. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Okay. Nope. Don't grab me, thank you. Come on. You can launch yourself at him. No, I need to wait for him to do an attack. So if he's not going to do an attack, this is going to be Back a really then. long time. Because he doesn't have anything that you can parry, I would imagine. You have to break his vitality. Well, you could do your grapple attack. Only if he falls down. No, that's two. Okay. Have you got any pellets? Uh, not on me. You've got it in your inventory. You can yep. pause. Bleah. You could pause. I could. Why didn't you? Because you can't pause all the time instantly. If you're moving, you can't pause. Every move that he has that doesn't have a perilous symbol is deflectable. Same is true for all bosses. Okay. I guess I'm kind of... Ah, you... What? Somewhere a pained cough rings out. The coughing and wheezing sounds of a man thinking only of his sick mother. Owning this item reduces one chances of receiving unseen aid. Oh. That means I can get um dragon rock sample from him. From who? From Inosuke. Inosuke Gensei. Go and get it then. Uh, He's really close. Yeah, he is, isn't he? So it's this way. 
Alright. Oh, I just thought you could use the firecracker. No, Save no, that. no. They all use spirit emblems. So it's never just On the a... ogre. Hmm? On the ogre. What? Use the firecracker on the ogre. No, use flame vent because it's better, right? Oh, okay. Alright, so in order to get to Inosuke safely, I'm going to go this way around. Hopefully I'll be able to avoid... You're not great at that. The game's not great at it. Like... You're against why? the wall too I know! Much. You're supposed to be able to do a wall jump, so I don't know why... Because it's at an angle. There you go. <sighs> I'm going to say this now. I didn't have this much issue controlling Bloodborne. And it's come up a number of times during Sekiro. And that might be salty. It might be me getting tilted, but I don't care. It happens. It didn't happen in Bloodborne. I have the dragon rod too. Flame vent stuns the chained on ogre longer than the firecracker, mm -hmm. even with no oil. Someone. Anyone. I'm here. Just put him on his back and take him to his mother. I could, but I'm not going to. You'll only make it worse. Forget about me. My mother. It costs one more symbol to use than a firecracker. But... Yeah, so I need to make sure I actually hit with it rather than, um, you know, just. Did you get the. the... My... my mother helped my mother. No, I'm not getting it from him. Maybe I'll only get it if I. if he dies. Let's talk to her again. Kill her. No, I'm not going to kill her. Why? Because I can get the sample without killing them. There's no point to doing that. You can't though, can you? Yes, yeah, you can. She's still alive. Yeah, but he's... You need to sample from him. Yeah, he's still alive. So yeah, there's so... no point killing anyone. There's, there's no point. Alright, so. So now I know. There's the two guards before the ogre. There's the cockerel, which I've already killed. There is the guy with the spear behind the ogre. Um, is there anyone else? I don't think so, right? Pass. Okay. Doo -doo -doo -doo. So, yeah. Oh, you only Speaks needed attack. one. Only one sample. That's what he said. Oh, so you can get it from multiple people. Interesting. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Oil's on. Flame vent's on. Let's go. Can you do a backstab when he's like this? I would imagine not. Do you not want to get the... Wow. Other guy. I dodged into that grab, I must say. That was my fault. Where's the other guy? Uh, oh, there he's he up is. there. So maybe you should get him whilst he's chained up. That's not a bad idea, actually. Just want to bring you back a little bit more. Come on, do an attack. Do an attack. One, Hit him two. with the oil now. Oh, okay. Why didn't you hit him with the oil? I should have done it, shouldn't I? I what? don't see why not. Oil! There we go. Dodge back. Not yet. Now we've got to dodge back. There we go. No! Just don't Ooh, forget about that, that other guy. Hmm, that should have hit me. One death blow. You're doing better now. Yes. You can grapple back to him if you mash L2 when thrown. Uh-huh. Burn, 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 Did you burn, use the oil? Burn. Yep. Good. Whoop. Okay. Do it again. Use oil now. Woo! He's got a drop kick. Alright. Uh-huh. Alright. No more flame vents. So switch to healing gold. Uh 
Huh? He's still burning. Cool. Oh, no. He's going to throw himself behind me, right? Yeah. Cool. I was worried he was going to throw me off the cliff for a second there. I don't think he can. I don't think it's in his um, code. Okay, that's death, but that's fine, because one more hit will kill him. There we go. Woo! Just don't forget about that guy. Yeah! Sweet! Prebby. First death blow. Ooh. Mm. Medicine rank one. A latent skill that increases the healing effect of recovery items. Medicinal knowledge is vital for a shinobi survival. Receiving wounds in battle is inevitable. The only way to learn such techniques is to be gravely injured time and time again by worthy opponents. Oh, okay. Nikora said it's definitely in his code to throw you off the cliff. That's why there's branches in the cliffside. Ah. <laughs> cool. I'll take that. Uh, right. And then up you go. Oh, I've got 16 well spirit up. emblems, or 15 spirit emblems from the Chained Ogre. Interesting. Go up to the left. Up to the left or up there? To the left. I think I've got to go there. Oh, why? Because. That's items. obviously the way you're supposed to go. Night Jar Monocular. <sighs> a bamboo tube used to see distant objects. Telescope. While Shinobi already have good vision, looking through this tube with one eye enables one to see even further. The Nightjar oh. Ninjas serve Ishin Ashina, guarding the rooftops of Ashina Castle. Their sharp eyes on lookout for any would-be trespassers. Not much escapes the eyes of a Nightjar. Um, you could have you could have backstabbed him. The chat saying you could have used Sneak Sugar. Oh yeah, that is a good point. But I wanted to do it the Flame Vent way, honestly. Gourd Seed, seed from which healing waters continuously spring forth, give to Emma to increase the maximum uses of the healing gourd. Hence why I think this is the way you're supposed to go. I know, I'm going to go back to the left in a minute, but I'm just picking up the items along here. Mm. The twisted gourd of medicinal waters was known throughout Ashenil since long ago, but it was the extraordinary healer Dogen and his pupil Emma who discovered the self replenishing nature of the seed. And a ceramic shard. Okay. Cool. Well, I am very pleased I managed to do Chained Ogre on the second attempt. You probably would have been able to do him on the first. That dude looks like a mini boss. Don't go in there. I'm not going to, I'm just saying. He looks like a mini boss. Hello? Oh, what? How does it not open from that side? Let's see. So it's like there, <laughs> right? Everybody's happy that you found a gold seed. Cool. Uh, Go to the freaking left. I know. I'm just seeing where that door was. There's no grapple points that I can see. So, all right, Mr. Shinobi. Uh. Yeah. After you've done this little bit, I think it's a good time to end the stream. I would say so as well, actually, because I'm quite pleased I managed to do Chain Ogre without too many attempts. So there's an item here. Balloon of wealth. Uh, oh, this is where you were trying to get me to grapple up to before. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I think that's it. Oh, no. Uh, can you get up there on the left? On the left here? Mm -hmm. I probably can. It looks like a place you can. Doesn't yeah. it? There we go. Okay. So, this is the higher level. This is back towards... Nothing yep. there. Okay. So, on the left-hand side... Like I said, the stuff here is way easier than purple, purple ninja dude. Yeah, and yeah. butterfly. Okay. Cool, alright. Well, nothing else here just yet. But, there's grapple point there. And that's where you just were. So, do you reckon drop into this main area with that dude there? Because he looks a bit imposing. Just go around to or the right. Or go again. around. Go around to the right. Go around to the freaking right. Go. So I want to see if there's any like illusionary walls or anything. Hug wall. Does not open from the side. Hug wall. Mm, nothing so far. Obviously, there's not going to be one on the other side because that opens out onto cliff. Yeah. Uh, Go around on the ledge. What to the right? Mm hmm Okay. Don't. You might be able to eavesdrop on me. them people as well. Bear in mind. True. That's turn to the right. Turn to the right. No, okay. Yeah, so let's go here, and then go right. Um, whoa. Where did that come from? Pass. 
Hmm. Everybody has heard I you. seem to have alerted the guards. Do you not want to eavesdrop on them? Well, I was going to, but I can't. So I'm just going to work my way back this way. Back? Uh, that's forward. What? No. Forward is that way where all the enemies are. This is backwards. It's not backwards. It is. No, it's not. You've gone over past the entire area. Temple posting. Turn back if you value your life. You can't behead the headless. Our swords and pikes did nothing. Ooh. This is a boss. No, this is ghosts. Okay. Yeah. So, if I'm over here... Uh, how do I get further on that way? Hmm. I'm not seeing any more grapple up. points. So, there's nothing there. Look there's up. a tree there, but I know there's a grapple point behind me, but what about this way? Just jump. Well, just jump is not great advice if there's not something to latch onto. There might be something over there, you don't know. Hmm. Ah, I don't wanna I don't wanna risk a leap of faith on that. There's so. a ledge down there. Ah, there is, isn't there? Okay. So it's sprint forward then hang. Sprint forward then hang. Oh yeah. yeah. I was right, just to clarify, mm -hmm. I didn't look at the chat. That that was Yeah, you saw it. I saw it before that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um AFAIK, what's that? As far as I know. Ah. Allus all illusionary walls have some kind of symbol or picture on that's different from the surrounding walls. No Dark Souls 2 randomly placed illusionary segments of solid rock. Mm hmm. Okay. So that's the item there. So I guess it's just a running jump here. Mm hmm. Uh, that's probably a grapple point from up just above me there. So Go on, go into the cave. Well, You're here now. I am here now, so... Five divine confetti. What is the divine confetti? It lets you hit ghosts. Okay. So... Here be ghosts. Be interested to see... Oh. Oh, this is his shinobi's eye in action. Because normally he wouldn't be able to see... Like this. This is night vision, basically. Uh. Spirit emblems? Yep. Can I jump? Mm -hmm. Yes, you can. There we go. You have a lot to lose right now if you die. Uh, it's a good point, but there's not a sculptor's idol here. So go home. So use homeward, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what, how much have I got? Yeah, I'm about halfway to the next skill point. Hmm. Just having a, another quick look. There's nothing else around here. Although, the, aha, there we go. The so. game goes are way scarier than the previous Dark Souls because they're based on Japanese angry spirits. Oh. Like the grudge or something. Uh -huh. Did we go this way before? Nope. What's up here? Ah, this will be the door from the other There's side. There's a thing. Right, okay. Ta da! Antidote powder! Doors open from the other side. What's that? Divine grass! A secret medicine that fully restores vitality and cures all status abnormalities. One small part of Ashina is exceeding the old, the ancient soil, rocks, and water that pervaded the land are said to have attracted the attention of the gods. The Dr. Dogen studied the plants in this ancient place, resulting in the recipe for this special medicine. Sweet! Okay, so I guess there's another item over there. I want to grab that at least. Lizards! Ugh. Ugh. Gatching sugar again. Is there another lizard? Another lizard. 
Woo. Okay, so just have another quick look around here. There's one down there. Hmm? Oh, no, it's a lock. Never mind. And that's towards the Chained Ogre. So I think we've closed the loop, and that's probably a good place to call it for today. So Sweet. We'll go through here. We've done quite a lot today. Yeah, we have. I'm glad. You've killed three bosses. No, I've killed... Three mini-bosses, sorry. Two mini-bosses. No, three oh, mini-bosses, yeah, actually. Unless Chained you Ogre is a, is a mini-boss, not a boss. Lady Butterfly is a boss. Lady Butterfly is a boss, and she's too hard for you right now. Yeah. So... Jump up here. Is that idle? There we go. Cool. And we shall... Let's travel, because we can talk to Emma next time. You've got blood for her. No, I don't, but we'll see if she's had any... Uh, I thought you did. ...progress. No, no, we didn't get the sample from uh, Inosuke. So yeah, that's going to wrap it up for us today, guys. So thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the stream. If you did, you can follow us at twitch.tv slash regrub, or if you're uh, already watching us live, you can click on the love heart icon to follow us. If you've missed any of our previous Sekiro streams, you can catch up on them on YouTube. I've been splitting them up into 30-minute uh, or so-ish episodes. I might do it a little bit shorter than that. Did you mean to that? do that? Uh, no, I didn't, but I'll do it. I might do it a little bit shorter than 30 minutes, depending on how much progress we make, and I might, like, cut stuff out. Like, the 30 minutes of attempts that we did for the first, you know, like, half an hour of the stream, then uh, I might cut that out. But otherwise, you can catch up on YouTube to find everything there. Yep. Um, watching us live is the best way to know when we do everything, basically. You can Plus also you follow can shout us at us when we do stupid stuff. Yeah, so. exactly. Yeah. You can tell us where to go. Yeah. You can also follow us on Discord and Twitter to get notified of when we go live. Uh, we'll have some discussions about what our next subscriber goal is. Face cam is an option. Uh, giving away a game is another one. So we'll see what we want to do for that in particular. Um... And the next stream we do will be myself on Wednesday afternoon at 5.30pm UK time for Wargroove. But we won't be having one at 9pm afterwards because we will be having Pimsy's friends staying over, I would imagine. Uh, yeah. Um, and yeah, if you check out our Twitch stream uh, on the schedule panel underneath, it'll have your time zones showing the time we go live correctly. Or it should be, at least. Um, so yeah, cool. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.